When we think about airplanes, most people picture their massive wings, engines, and the long fuselage that carries passengers and cargo. But what many don't realize is that one of the most important aspects of modern aviation is hidden inside the wings themselves, the fuel tanks. Unlike cars, which typically store fuel in a tank beneath the body, airplanes primarily keep their fuel in the wings. It may sound unusual at first, but there are very practical, engineering and safety-related reasons for this design choice. In this video, we're going to dive deep into why aircraft store fuel in the wings, the benefits of this arrangement, and how it impacts everything from performance to safety. Let's explore right here on History of Simple Things. First, let's think about the amount of fuel an airplane actually needs. Commercial airliners consume thousands of gallons of fuel on a single long-haul flight. For example, a Boeing 747 can hold over 57,000 gallons of fuel, and even smaller passenger jets carry several thousand gallons. That's a tremendous volume of highly flammable liquid that has to be stored somewhere in a way that's both efficient and safe. Simply placing such a massive tank in the fuselage would take away valuable passenger and cargo space, not to mention add unnecessary weight to the central body. By putting the fuel in the wings, engineers are able to maximize space efficiency and keep the fuselage clear for passengers, cargo, and essential systems. Another key reason is balance and weight distribution. Airplanes need to maintain a stable center of gravity in order to fly safely. If the fuel were stored in a single large tank inside the fuselage as it burned off during flight, the plane's balance could shift dramatically, potentially making it difficult for pilots to control. Distributing the fuel within the wings spreads out the weight evenly across the aircraft's structure. This ensures that as fuel is consumed, the change in weight distribution happens gradually and symmetrically. Having fuel stored in the wings makes it much easier to maintain stability and reduces the amount of constant trim adjustment needed by the pilots. Storing fuel in the wings also helps with something called bending relief. Think of an airplane's wing as a long beam sticking out from the fuselage. When the plane is in flight, Lift generated by the wings pulls them upward, while the weight of the aircraft pulls downward from the fuselage. This creates bending stress at the wing root, which is where the wing attaches to the body of the plane. Now, if you fill the wings with fuel, that weight actually counteracts some of the bending forces. The downward pull of the fuel weight balances the upward lift, reducing stress on the wing structure. In simpler terms, the fuel acts like ballast that strengthens the wings and helps prevent them from flexing too much. This design makes the aircraft both more durable and more efficient in the long run. Safety is another huge factor. Aviation design always prioritizes minimizing risks, especially when it comes to handling flammable fuel. By keeping the fuel in the wings, it is physically separated from passengers, cargo, and most of the critical systems inside the fuselage. In the unfortunate event of an accident or fire, this separation helps reduce the risk of fuel igniting near people on board. Additionally, in many aircraft, the engines are mounted beneath the wings, directly adjacent to the wing fuel tanks. This layout allows for shorter fuel lines and pumps, which lowers the chance of leaks and makes the fuel delivery system simpler and more reliable. Shorter fuel lines also mean less weight, which further improves efficiency. There's also an aerodynamic advantage to this design. Wings are already designed to be hollow in many areas, with internal structures that support both strength and aerodynamics. 
engineers realize that these hollow sections are perfect for integrating fuel tanks without compromising the external shape of the wing. The fuel tanks, often called wet wings, because the wing structure itself is sealed to hold the liquid, make efficient use of existing space. This clever integration means there's no need for bulky external tanks that would increase drag and reduce fuel efficiency. By putting the fuel inside the wings, designers keep the aircraft streamlined and able to fly longer distances with less fuel burn. Another point to consider is the practicality of fueling and maintenance. Fueling an aircraft through the wings is straightforward. Refueling trucks or hydrant systems simply connect to access points near the wing, and the fuel is pumped directly into the tanks. This makes ground operations faster and more efficient, which is crucial for airlines that rely on quick turnaround times at airports. Maintenance crews can also inspect the wing tanks more easily since they're part of the wing's internal structure, reducing the need for complicated systems that would otherwise be required if the fuel were stored elsewhere. Military aircraft and smaller general aviation planes also benefit from storing fuel in the wings, although the exact configurations vary depending on the mission. Fighters and bombers often carry additional external tanks for extended range, but their primary storage is still within the wings. This demonstrates how universal the wing fuel storage concept has become across the aviation industry, whether for commercial, military, or private use. Now, you might be wondering, are there any downsides to storing fuel in the wings? The main challenge is structural. Since the wings are relatively thin compared to the fuselage, engineers have to carefully design internal compartments, pumps, and valves to make sure the fuel is distributed evenly and does not slosh excessively during flight. There are also risks of water condensation forming inside the tanks, which must be managed through careful fuel system design. But overall, these challenges are minor compared to the overwhelming advantages of storing fuel in the wings. The reason airplanes store fuel in their wings boils down to a combination of efficiency, safety, and smart engineering. Wings provide the ideal space for massive amounts of fuel without sacrificing passenger or cargo capacity. They help balance the aircraft's weight and center of gravity, reduce structural stress, keep fuel separated from people and systems, and streamline the refueling process. What might seem like just a simple design choice is actually a carefully engineered solution that supports the safety, performance, and reliability of modern aviation. The next time you look out the window of a plane and see the wings stretching out into the sky, remember that they're not just keeping you in the air, they're also holding the very fuel that makes the journey possible. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.